So, uh, how many dreams tonight? Unfortunately, I left mine home. One? One. I, I have, have to one. Yeah, I have a question. I, I have a question. What's the difference between a dream and a, um, a waking, like an extrasensory perception? Or do both? Is it the same thing? Sure. Sure. You want me to read it? Yes, please. Is it okay? <coughs> the okay. magic of the light. Read it, thank you. I was at the beginning of some event and I was asked to help set up some fencing. There were four of us. There was a little confusion about how to set up these fences and I guess we were trying to figure it, figure it out. I think one of the guys was the, the leader but then I was like, it was like I was also the leader or maybe he asked me to be the leader. So then we started, and I think I started saying how we could do it. <clears throat> but then one of the guys started doing it a different way, so that I thought he was a problematic person. They were measuring the length of something, and then I thought we would need three pieces for that length. But he was like, okay, so we'll do two. From a bit of distance away, I was like, so how long is it? And he said the number... And then I was like, well, you'll need three. Then he said something that wasn't very audible. <clears throat> but I thought it needed three to allow for overlap. Then the other guy that was supposed to be the leader walked past me and gave a little apology. Not sure what he said exactly. I think I went to a room for a second, maybe the restroom. But I saw a little pamphlet or something and it said that you could put up to it said that you could put up about 20 of those fences in a day which was quite a lot they are saying that it's easier than i thought it was uh then i then i walked out and i was going to grab this cut but then the other leader grabbed it and said sorry i need this it wasn't a group thing anymore now everyone would set up their own fences. I was thinking about leadership and stuff like that. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. It has something to do with leadership. Um, it seems. It seems like. Mm, <coughs> Seems like maybe I could have been more assertive, and a, a little more. Yeah, or maybe a little more than what a little that, more. What does that mean? <laughs> um, okay, that's true. What else do you see in the dream? <coughs> that's new. That's new. <laughs> well, I didn't. Um, I thought it was going to be 
harder than it than what the instruction said. So that was kind of surprising. <coughs> um, I thought I had a pretty good idea of how it need, how long it would take or how much was involved, mm -hmm. but I think uh, I I overestimated it. What do you make of the dream now? I don't know. <clears throat> well, what do you make of it? What do you make of it? Um, See, what's different about this dream than your other dreams? Since the same issue came up about leader and speaking. What's different? Uh, yeah. Would you agree that you have had other dreams where the issue of leadership and taking a position, taking a stand? Mm -hmm. So it's the same old dream. No, well, I did. I did something different. I did. Um, I did take a bit of a stand <laughs> in this. It's, Take one. I did. Um, I did try to um, direct the work. Like, I wasn't completely passive, is what I'm saying. But I, I don't know what what else would be different. What was it like? when you read the information in the restroom. <clears throat> what did that mean as you walked out? Come on. <clears throat> in terms of the task at hand, and who or what the leader should be. Come on. Well, it meant that it would be easier than, than what I thought it was. We would... Let me ask you a question again. What was it like after you left the... Come on. You're reading the information there, you left the restroom. What was that like? Um, Stay in mind. Come on. <sighs> Surprised and maybe maybe relieved. What? Surprised. And More. Maybe a little bit relieved. Um, Okay, look here. What did that information allow you to understand? That it was a simple process to put together the fences. Now you're a leader and now you have the information. How are you doing? Well, I don't, I don't share that information. What do you think of that? Yeah, that's not good. It's, um... So, see, being a leader is something we've seen before that you, that's problematic and not putting into words what you see. But this is adding information that could change your position you would then be, come on, 
the leader. Then I would be leading. And then you would be leading. That's a major difference. Mm. Now, you, you see, you, you're not really answering my question. Let me do it again. Here there's a lot of confusion about who and what to do and difficulties. These are all difficulties, right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. <coughs> That's right, yeah. Now, what did you just see? Well, I just realized that I also just saw the instruction manual. And we were confused about how to set it up. So that's, that's a key right there. That Therefore, what would that do? Share <laughs> all of the confusion. We would have instructions. It would resolve it. Yeah. And, um, and it may even resolve the leadership thing. Okay. That's why I had to ask you, what is it like in the restroom when you read that information? You said relief. But you see, the implications are very serious. You would become the leader, you would know what to do, you would organize it, it would be successful. Right. When you're in the restroom and you read that information, what was it like? In the dream only. That's really hard to answer. Yes, that was, um, sure. <laughs> yes. <laughs> what was that like? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kind of like uh, surprise and curious because it's like there's a mystery there. Because uh, it's kind of like. 20 it's, it's it's a i'm reading it's a big it's a big claim that i'm reading and it's kind of like puts me in a state of um i mean i'm curious i'm curious about what how would this happen how would this um but you're getting the answer i got the I, no i got a claim huh? i got a claim that you could do 20 in a day yeah. but the answer would be inside the the instruction manual yeah. so i'm um, uh, curious and so look here give yourself a name for what you're doing okay. you have the secret uh -huh. right you know what it would do to the work and your leadership and you're not a finisher. And I'm not, um, I'm not using it, I'm not applying it, and I'm not even looking at it properly. What do I call that? No. Um, hey, look here. Turning a blind eye? Look, look here. If this was a battle plan, and you're a soldier in a similar situation... Oh, yeah. Then that's... Uh, that's like, like a, like, I don't know, like a, like a general that's sleeping on the job or something like that. Uh, well, will you get a medal for it? No. It's more like, I better hope that nobody finds out. Right. <laughs> Thank you. So, Come on, what name do you want to call the way you're functioning? <clears throat> Sloppy general. Um. Come on. And you keep it to yourself. You don't use the information. I don't know, what do you call that? So it allows those people to continue in their mess. Right. Well, I'm withholding information, and... That would have assured your position, the success of the object. Well, come on, it's a major... Mm. See, we want to discover, if we can, what kept you 
right, from using that information. And the dream, what was it like there for as you walked out with all of that information, see here it is, there you go. Say nothing, do nothing with the information of God. What state of mind is that? Um, it's... In the dream. Not second-guessing it now. In the dream. Yeah. It's a state of mind. What state of mind is that? ignoring it, uh, or simply ignoring it, or making you believe you don't know it. Well, what state of mind is it? It's a state of some interesting state of mind, of the dream. It seems like I, I'm not... Um, for, for some reason, it's like the... The things that happened before that put me in a certain position. And that position prevents me from using that information. Good. What position? Um, like It's like I'm already being ignored to a certain not extent. Not, not in the dream. Well, like, that guy wasn't listening to me. That's what I mean. Well, um, I am also the leader. Or he asked me to be the leader. So, right. But, but I mean, what, after, what happened after that? I know, yeah. Um, but the, I but think that's the beginning, you see. Right, right. I'm saying that what happened... After that, put me in a certain state of mind. That is. What is it? Uh, uh. See, it's the state of mind before you went into the restroom. What was it like when the guy said, hey, you've become the leader? What did that do to you? What did that do in the dream? Huh. Um. That was the leader. I was also... Two states of mind, see? Before and after. So what was it like when he said, okay, you're the leader? What did it do to you? So it's, it's very hard to remember, but okay. I would say it was like, it's kind of like a little bit shaky, a little bit like... Um, I didn't feel um, I, like I felt a little bit uh, shaky, <laughs> like not um, like I'm not stable on my feet. I'm kind of like I'm not aligned or something. <clears throat> Are you familiar with that state of mind? Uh, yes or no? It's just a bit vague. That's all. But look at the power of it has. Kind of unsure. You can put words on it, 
then we can trace it back to where it comes from. Either way. But if you don't if you don't have that information I don't yeah. I don't I don't have that. I don't really mm-hmm. even I'm, even those words are not very Okay. Yeah. But um but I do I I can describe the state after that Go ahead. better. Um that was that was kind of I felt a bit small mm-hmm. a little bit uh, at what point in the dream when when uh, I don't know if doing and it. you have to be the leader no after that I was thinking how we could do it the wheelbarrow I think when when the guy at the start of the second paragraph when the guy started doing it a different way mm-hmm. so I thought he was problematic yeah. and then I think it started there and then it got worse when when he didn't um, agree with me when I said we'll need three yeah, he's already what role is that man playing in terms of this episode or scenario. Come on. Well, he's trying to be the leader as well. That's right. And he's taking over. Right. What did that do to you? Come on. That... Like it's like I'm losing my voice. What's uh, that like? It's like it's kind of powerless. It's, uh, 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 small. I already said small. Um, See, this stage, this stage uh, preceded going into the restroom, see? Yeah. That's and right, yeah. If you went into the restroom, having experienced this... I'm still in that. You're still in it. Maybe you're still in that same stage. Yeah. Right? Okay. Uh, where does that go? Well, you know the game. Where does it go? Mm. Right, you lost your voice, like losing your voice. Right, powerless, small. Where does it go? Powerless and small. It's it's when um, when my when my dad would take me with him to these little trips, and then he would um, when he talks to people, whoever it is, um, that it's kind of like I can't. When he's talking, I can't be part of it. That puts me in that state. It's kind of like he's the only one that's allowed to have fun and talk. Okay. And Do you have any idea how old, how old we are at this time? Um, Okay. 
I mean, I can, I have like a... So can you tell me what was going on? Do you have anything, have any content? Um, what, what was going on? What was he doing? What was he saying? How was he relating to the other people that you were around? This happened um, many times. Many times, so it's a yeah, bit. Well, <laughs> pick any of them then. Okay. So I'll go with when when uh, some guests some guests come to the house, and then he's like entertaining them or doing this thing. And what, uh, what would happen? <coughs> he would <coughs> he would make jokes and he would. Uh, talk and he might even make fun of, of me or of my mom or something and then he, um, it's kind of like I, I'm not allowed to talk I'm not allowed like I know I'm not allowed to like oppose him even though I could say something and you know I, I, I know that I thought of things to say and stuff but I know I can't do that so then uh, so I would I would be in that state. If he's doing that many times, and he's making fun of you, and there is no opposition, right? That leads into this state, doesn't it? Yeah. Right. Then that blocks you from using whatever it is that you might use to your advancement and the group's advantage. So therefore, what should you have told the guy? At that moment, what you told him. You see what he's doing, right? He's doing that. Huh? What are you going to do? Well, I would say, why are you, why are you so threatened by somebody else talking? Not good enough. You're not dealing with the situation. He's making fun of you. Not allowed to oppose him. What are you going to tell him? He's doing it in front of others. So they have it there for a view of you too. Right? Um. Tell him. Like, um, why are you, n not why are you, I would say, hey, you're, you're like, uh, Say you're, you're like you're squishing your own son. You're. Um... Well, you're not dealing with them. The fact that he's doing it, either that, or as a guest in your own house. Come on, put the two put them in there. Oh, okay. Um... It's like whenever, whenever you, whenever there are people around, you, um, uh, it's so hard. Uh, sure, it is hard. Go ahead. Whenever there are people around, you have to be the center of attention. And you put down your son and your wife, and like, and it. Can I ask him why he does it? Yeah. Come on, what are you going to ask him? I would ask him, has anyone ever done that to you? No, getting better. 
something you learn? Right. So, what, uh, what else do you want to say about it? So hmm? now you're like passing on this yeah. tradition. Yeah. And um, blocking me from being myself. <laughs> <laughs> That's important, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay, let's do a little bit about uh, midwifery. Uh, All right? Hold it.